The challenge for today is type free hair with your eyes closed in the comments and try to spell it correctly. Good luck! Hi, have you ever wanted to get a free Roblox hair that looks like this? Well, in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can get it. It would be very much appreciated if you could like this video and also subscribe. It means a lot to me. Take that aside, I'm going to show you a full tutorial on how to get this free hair. So make sure to watch the whole video. But before that, if you want free Robux or gift cards, check out collectbucks.net. You can link out your account without a password. You do not need any passwords for this. By earning points from this website, you can get free Robux and also gift cards. As you can see, there are a lot of things that you can choose from. You can also put my code in which is blue wolf right here i'm at the cash out page and i just cashed out some robux so here are the pending robux the link for this website will be in the description i forgot to mention this later in the video but you have to get this extension from the chrome web store the link for this will be in the description below this is the very first step that you have to do now it's time to get serious follow these steps along with watching the video so you know what to do there's a big surprise at the end of the video so yeah let's get started okay so as you can see i have some links here which will be linked in the which will be linked in the description below so you can use these links where i show you okay so first off you're going to be copying this link which is the render mesh one once you have basically copied it you're going to be pasting it right on top here just like that and then you will be taken to this link you will have to click on download which is right here so the extension that we downloaded actually allows us to download this mesh you're going to click on download as mesh if you download it as a different file i don't think it will work so just click on it and you're basically done as you can see it is downloading right here i've just put it in the desktop like dragged it to the desktop just so it can be easier for me afterwards you can do this as well do the same thing with the other link as well you're going to be copying it and then pasting it right on top of here and this is how it's going to look like again you're going to be clicking on the download thing right there this is how it is going to look like you can drag this down to the desktop if you want to so as you can see we have both our mesh and the texture ready here now all we have to do is put them in the textures folder in roblox the way that we are going to be doing it is by going to the search bar and we are going to be typing in roblox player and then you're going to be right clicking on roblox player and then click on open file location once that opens you're going to do that once again right click and then click on open file location once you go there you will see this click on content and then go to avatar this is where you'll find the heads folder click on it and then you will see the head meshes right here we will need to drag our own mesh that we had downloaded into this folder but before doing that we will have to get our original head mesh out of here so just get it out of here by simply dragging it out of this folder you can move it to the desktop or wherever you want if you want to create another folder you can now let's get our other head mesh that we had downloaded originally and put it here you're just going to drag it in this way it should say move to heads when it does you can leave it there as you can see all of these meshes have a head in it and this one just feels left out so we will have to name that as head mesh i'm just kidding that's not the reason but it's a really important reason why we're doing it so go ahead and rename it as head head dot mesh i'm pretty sure there will already be mesh written there so don't type it twice please but yeah there you go now it doesn't feel left out anymore now let's go back and go over to textures this time instead of avatar all right so move over to textures this is where all of the textures are you're going to scroll down and find face in this you can't be lazy and search it up you have to find it this is in alphabetical order so you can search it but then it will be kind of difficult so just find it it will be really early here you will find it and then put it in another folder just like the original head mesh put it in another folder or you can delete it now you're going to be putting this texture right here also it should say move to textures okay so just drop it there and basically again this looks really odd so let's rename it this time you're going to be renaming your the one that you had pasted here as face after renaming it as face you're basically done now you have to open roblox desktop site and once you're here you're going to be removing whatever face you're wearing for example, I'm wearing this face, I'm just gonna remove it and it looks like the hair texture. I know it looks really weird now, but we have to make this work. The last step, the second last step, 
is go on classic heads and remove whatever head you're wearing for example i'm wearing this cheeks head i'm just going to be clicking on it to remove it basically so make sure that you don't have any heads equipped this is how your avatar should look like and this is the last step go on build scroll down until you find r6 you'll have to click on r6 and there you go this is how it looks like it took a lot of time for me to make this video it would be really appreciated if you liked it and also subscribe if you haven't already i like this hair i feel like it's it looks a little taller because i'm in r6 but still it's like really cool there are no hacks no um just like you guys say no scams no glitches included in this and to those who are asking yes this is completely safe you won't get banned for this i literally don't have that hair in my inventory and i'm very thing about this is that it is only visible to you but it also has its uses so if you want to get this go ahead and get this now let me know if you want me to make more hair videos in the comments below i will try my best to upload as often as possible for these hair videos so you get plenty of options and yeah that is basically it for today's video today's video was kind of long but yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you watched till here, here is a cookie for you. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Goodbye, everyone.